Whew, what good this show. All I want to know, which one of y'all got me up this morning? <laughs> uh, to be honest with you guys, it's about 1.30 in the morning and I'm showing up for you again. 1.30 in the morning, I'm over here at Anytime Fitness. Haven't been here in, in a while, but you know, when you get those gym memberships that you continuously pay for every single month, I have Anytime Fitness, I have LA Fitness, I think I also have Planet Fitness, but I like Anytime Fitness because you can come here anytime and it's a little bit closer to home. Now Planet Fitness, we have a 24 hour one as well, but I'm gonna get inside here and I don't know exactly <laughs> what workout routine I'm going to do, but I am gonna start on a treadmill, something light, and we're just gonna, we're just gonna keep going. Whew. Get my little smart water up over here. <laughs> oh my goodness, man, it's a little bit different. And the reason I usually rock a water in the gym because I'm exerting myself a little bit more than when I'm just doing regular walks in the park. I want two more of those from you. Give me one more. Good morning, it's 5 a.m. and I'm showing up. And I'm showing up and I'm here for you, baby. I'm here for you. I'm here for every individual that over the past three days been leaving your boy messages You've hit my Instagram. You've hit us right here on YouTube. You hit my email piece, baby. And you guys are leaving me life. You are feeding me energy. You are sharing your stories. And yo, you're touching my soul. You're touching my soul, baby. <laughs> I don't even know where to begin, but what I'm going to start doing and it's gonna happen on this walk too. I just wanna share with you guys, just, just a couple either, whether it's stories, whether it's comments, any and everything, any and everything that can get you guys motivated to show up. And I'm not just talking about, you know, showing up to the park, you know, to walk, or showing up to the gym. I'm talking about showing up to live your best life. I wanna look at you. I wanna look at you when I'm talking. And so many of you are telling me about your projects that started to break you on the inside because things have been moving slow. And by the time you get finished telling me about these projects, by the very end of your story, it's Dame, I'm picking it back up and I'm going stronger with it because you're not giving up, because you're showing up. You're not giving up, you're showing up. <laughs> I love y'all for that. I love y'all for that. I chose the wrong shorts today. Why? These joints are uh, falling and I've cinched them pretty tight. Arm switch. I sensed these joints pretty tight this morning, y'all. But uh, we're gonna keep it going. We're gonna keep it going. Now, hey, dig. I'm gonna do some picture and picture action. Uh, top of the screen, whatever. Of me showing up at one o'clock this morning. Yes, <laughs> four hours ago, I went to the gym. And four hours later, I'm here in the park. I went to the gym this morning and I wanted to do some motivational speaking to you guys at the gym. Music was playing though. And I was like, eh, YouTube ain't beating me in the head, copyrights. So what you'll see is our picture in picture of me starting the process over. Just like you've been starting your process over. But many of you, you're already on this journey. You've been on this journey. Whether it's for weight loss, whether it's just for you one, 
a better form of health about you. Or maybe you just love exercising. You've been on this journey. But here we are together. Here we are growing together, showing up, showing out together, becoming more, becoming more together. I have a nice breeze going on right now, y'all. It's brisk and I feel better than I did yesterday, definitely. I'm noticing that there's more pep in my step. I got more bounce to the ounce. What do you have and how are you feeling? I'm gonna always ask that to you. How are you feeling, please? In the comment section below, let us know how you're feeling. And this is what I want. Because so many of you are leaving so many comments. It's hard to read everything. So many great stories and it's hard to read everything. This is what I want. Just so I know we're interacting as a community supporting each other. Can you please make sure that you reach back out to your foodie fam brothers and sisters and let them know that you're showing up for them. You read those stories, you read the comments. I don't care if you just give it a like and don't even say anything. Just let them know that you hear them and that you see them because that's what we all need. We just need, that this, need to know there's someone out there that can hear us and someone that can see us. And we're not alone. We're not alone in the struggle. We're not alone in the grind. We're not alone in the hustle. And somebody cares. That's all we need. And I honestly believe the more we start doing that, the more we start doing that, we are going to build a community here of successful minds. There's enough toxicity on this platform. There's enough negative. I've watched creators over the years tear each other down for whatever reason. They do it for views. They do it because they want to get known, whatever. I've watched that. I don't want that to be this. What I want now it's for us to rebuild this platform in a way where more individuals are showing up to support the next person. That's all, that's all I want. Showing up to say, hey, listen, I see you trying. I see you struggling to show up to be the best version of yourself let me offer you a hand and pick you up. See, I'm walking right now because somebody right now is watching this video and they're down, they're down y'all, they're down. And just by me filming this, filming my journey, I'm offering my hands out to those individuals to bring them back up with me and saying, we got this together. You're not alone. Nope, you're not alone. I don't know 100% my purpose here on earth. I've been on autopilot for far too long. But what I do know is that a lot of you have been watching these motivational walking talks and you've been supporting and you've been sharing some of your deepest, most raw emotions with me and with other strangers. If this can grow into something big, something great, what we're saying, listen, <laughs> you beautiful minds, there's so many of you out there. We're here for you. We wanna be part of your journey. We wanna be part of your success story. We wanna be part of your greatness. I honestly believe we could begin to make change in this world. And maybe, maybe that's my purpose. 
right? Maybe that's my purpose. Maybe that's why you guys feed me the energy to get me up extra early in the morning to provide anything, just a little something, something right back to you to say thank you. And I thank you. Oh, do I thank you. Now, I love this part of the park because this is when the motivation really begins. Whew. And this is when I know <laughs> I'm doing what I'm supposed to be doing because I start to feel it more, right? Always right here at this part of the park. Ladies and gentlemen, what do you want out of this thing called life? What is it that you need? Please share it with us. Put it in the comment section because it's like you putting it out into the universe like we discussed the other day. Put it in the comment section. I want you to type what you need and I don't care what it is. I wanna read about it. I wanna read about it because soon, soon I'm gonna start following up with random people. Me personally, not no assistant, no, me personally, I'm gonna start following up with random people. And I'm gonna find out what it is that you're doing to live in your purpose and to step up and step out to begin chasing after your dream. So I need you in the comment section to let me know what it is that you need, what it is that you want, and what are the current steps you're taking to acquire it? Ah. Because why? <laughs> you know why. Where we at? We're not stopping. We're not let letting anything. We're not allowing for anything to stop us. We're not stopping. We see the stop sign. We see those that try to block us from our blessings, from our dreams, from our greatness. We keep going. We keep going. I'm not going to allow you to stop because you're not allowing me to stop. You said, Dame, you show up every morning. And if you can do that much and you can give us a little bit of your time and a little bit of your energy, we're going to show up for you. We're going to show up for you. We're going to be in the comment section, motivating you, pushing you to go harder, to go stronger, to be better. Right? Because that's what you're doing. That's what you're doing. We're three days in. That's what you're doing. Oh, and it feels good. Oh, it feels good. It's like, I almost feel as if I'm power walking today. And I don't know what it is, but I honestly feel as if I got around the park much faster today. And I don't know. I don't know, y'all. It's Friday. It's Friday, man. And, and I love you guys. I love you for your ability to be able to help others, even when you're broke. Not broke as in financially, your soul. For those of you that are broken on the inside, you still show up for others. And a lot of people don't know how hard that is to do. When you're at your lowest point, when you feel like you can't give anymore, you still put in a phone call to check on family and friends to see how they're doing. And <laughs> you're so selfless that you don't even share what you're going through. They don't stop to ask because they can't hear it in your voice. And when they see you face to face, they don't see the pain on you because you give them a smile. You hide being broken on the inside behind that smile. This is what I need for you to do. I need for you to let somebody know. Morning. Good morning, how you doing? Good, good. How are you? You're doing good, sir, doing good. I need for you to let somebody know. And this is why. When the soul is broken, when you feel as if 
you can't go on and you can't do any more and you're hurting, but you refuse to show it because you're trying to be strong for yourself. Let someone else help you. You can't show up to be the very best version of yourself and truly help others without allowing someone to help you. I can't show up every single morning to have these talks with you guys without asking for help like I did in my last video. And you guys, you, what? <laughs> what? You said, dang, stop playing what you need. What do you need? My reality? Y'all gave me what I needed. You gave me the energy. You gave me the positivity. You gave me the encouragement to keep going. That's it. That's it. For those of you who hurt every single day, and I don't know what's hurting you. I have no idea. I don't know if it's the bills that might be backing up. I don't know if it's the relationship that you might be in. I don't know if you lost somebody close to you. I don't know what your pain is, but I want you to know we're here for you. If nothing else, we're here for you. I want you to put it in the comment section and I want you to leave it there. And family, family, this is the time we have to come together. I want you to read the pain of others and I want you to offer some encouragement, uplift them, support them. I'm gonna go through the comments. I'm gonna start leaving behind responses to see what I can do to help. Because now, more than ever, we have to do it for each other. Be more of a support group, that family, right? That's what it's all about. These mornings, as beautiful as they are, I'm sitting here and I'm talking to you guys and I know somebody's hurting on the inside. And that hurt, that pain, it stops people from living in their truth. It stops people from shining bright. It stops people from building their empire. So in order for you to live in your truth, in order for you to shine bright, in order for you to build your empire, let us help you, All right? Mentally, we all go through something. Some of us, both mental and physically. But mentally, we all go through something. A little bit goes a long way. That's all I'm saying. A little bit goes a long way. Here we are. Look at this, man. Look at that. I feel like we're three quarters through the park right now. I do. I honestly do. But today, excuse me. Sorry about the burp. Today, I just... I feel it different, y'all. I feel it different. I feel better every single day I show up for you guys. I feel better. I really do. Thank you. Thank you many times over. Uh, my hustle today, interviews for my Netflix show begin. <laughs> I got a big one today. And <laughs> the more I'm starting to think about the show, and as we get closer to June 9th, the more excited I get. Because you guys are about to see something that's a very different version of me. Not Dame Drop showing up to Netflix, <laughs> but Damon Patterson. I don't let people in on my life. I, I haven't at least, All right? But now with these walks, I'm gonna start letting you guys in because I know the only way I can help anybody else is I have to be real with you. I have to show the emotions. I have to show who I am, not the entertainer, but the person. And when I do that, right? When I do that, it allows other people to feel a little more comfortable with showing who they are. They're like, hold on. If Dame could do it, I could do it. Hi right, guys. Real quick, so I'll let you guys know. I came in today with the mindset that I was gonna hit the treadmill and then I was gonna do the circuit 
between legs, chest, arms. But we're slowly getting back into the gym. And what I'm going to do, because they play music in here, and you guys can hear it, YouTube, I don't want to get hit with copyright. But I'm going to work my way up to hitting every machine in here, in this section. And when we're hitting every machine <clears throat> frequently in this section and it starts getting a little bit easier, I'm going to move on to the next part of the gym. But I have to start somewhere. Your boy's knees aren't what they used to be. <laughs> I can definitely feel that. I'm probably walking right now and talking to you guys. It's currently 2 o'clock a.m. I should catch sunlight somewhere about 5.30ish, so I'm gonna try to get to the park closer to 5.30. I'm gonna be in the same outfit. And I'm gonna walk the park and I'm gonna talk to you guys. And we're just gonna keep motivating each other. We're gonna keep showing up for each other. This is probably where we start going uphill, y'all. <laughs> Your boy's still gonna feel it. Whew. Your boy's still gonna feel it. And I'm okay with that. Here's the crazy part. When it comes to the keys to success, everybody's gonna tell you, I have the key to success. I'm gonna tell you, I don't. I don't have the keys to success. I don't have a three-step, a five-step program that I'm gonna try to sell you on for $19.99, $59.99, 100 and nine, nope, nope. Because what works for me won't work for somebody else. We all differ. A lot of people wanna be led because it's easier for them. And so to buy into somebody else's dream won't take much, right? That's their dream. That's what makes them wealthy. You're buying into it. This one I'm gonna tell you, and this is gonna be free. Show up for yourself. Simple. It has been our ongoing theme ever since I started walking. Show up for yourself. Don't give up, but show up, right? That's it, that's it, simple. Don't give up, but show up. You already know what it is that you have to do, right? You know what it is that you've been building, what you've been working hard on, whether by yourself or in a group, you know exactly what it is. You don't need nobody to tell you about your business. You know your business. But Dame, what if I don't know what I wanna do, but I wanna do something? <laughs> don't give up, show up. It's okay not knowing. It's okay going in blind. I can sit here and tell you how many different businesses I've tried to start over the past 20 years, how many fails I had, how many times I fell and I got right back up and, I, and how much money I've lost and I got right back up. Yeah, that's real. In this grind that you're gonna be on, you are gonna lose friends, you are gonna lose money, and you are going to fail. Boop, it's gonna happen. That's a reality check for you. Don't worry about it. Don't worry about any of it. Keep going. You show up and you keep going because your dream is right around the corner. It's right around the corner. All the times that you've fallen and you've gotten back up, you're still alive, right? You're still breathing, right? All that means is for you to try again and maybe try something different, right? Maybe try something different. If you've been at the same thing for years, five, 10, 15, 20 years, and it's not working, try another avenue. I can tell you right now, I've tried several different businesses that have all failed <laughs> and I kept going. Once you two popped, once that popped for your boy, I kept going. I didn't stop with YouTube, I kept going. You see what I'm saying to you? You're gonna find what works for you and you're gonna keep going. You are. Look, the truck 
is right there. Look, it's 22 minutes. We're shaving off. It seems like a minute a day, right? About a minute a day. That's the motivation for me. Don't give up. You show up. And then, in time, we're going to watch your glow up. You heard what I'm saying to you? <laughs> oh, it's going to happen. Thank you for waking me up this morning. Thank you for giving me the strength I needed to go to the gym and to come to the park. I got the same outfit on that I had in the gym. You know what I'm saying? Same exact outfit. Four hours later, I'm here, baby. I'm here. I love y'all like soul food. We're going to run it up. We're going to show up. In the comment section, let us know what you're going through. Please, I want to read it. I want to be able to respond to folks. Foodie fam, I need for you to help other brothers and sisters that we have right here in the foodie fam. All right, we're family. We help each other. So when I'm reading these comments, I would love to see other responses to people going through it, saying, look, keep your head up. We're here for you. We're supporting you. We're all going to work through this together. Can you please do that for your boy? All right, it's Friday. We're gonna go into the weekend. I don't know if I'm filming my walks or my gyms during the weekend. I make no promises. I feel that this week I've earned a food review. So maybe you'll see a food review this weekend, I don't know. But if nothing else, Monday through Friday, you're going to see this. You're going to see my support. You're going to see my love. You're going to see my care. I am going to put it out there. And I'm gonna let you know what's going on with me my struggles, all right, my success moves, and I want the same from you. Because the only way I can do this, I need you. I need your help. I need your energy, all right? It's your main man, Dame Drops. Have a great weekend.